You want your player character to easily be able to interact with multiple types of objects in your game when you hit a button like the E key on PC. You want to open doors, maybe open chests, pick up objects, um, talk with NPCs. And you want to do this by just sending out a signal from the player character blueprint that says, okay, I've pressed it and you want those things to be looking for that signal. You don't want to be casting or anything like that. How do you do this in a clean way? So we do that through blueprint interfaces. They basically hold messages or signals that tell the game that a signal has been received. And we send that to specific objects who are looking for uh, that message. So right click, let's create a blueprint interface. We're gonna call this BPI for blueprint interface, underscore interact. This is gonna be looking for interactions so I'm going to double click it and the first thing, it has this new function that's waiting to be named and we're going to call this interact. This is kind of the name of the message or the name of the signal. We're going to hit compile. We're not going to do any programming in here. This is basically just holding a message. Save it, close it. Now in my first person character blueprint, I'm sending out a raycast. Here it is. Um, if you are curious, this is just pressing E. I've set that in the uh, project settings through bindings. And we're basically just sending out a raycast and it's going to check for what that raycast hits. Does that object that the raycast hit, can it receive these messages? And that's used, that's been done through the does implement interface node. So does the object that we've hit in, implement this interface? Which interface? The interact that we just made, the BPI interact. After that, we're gonna check, well, does it? And now, if it does, we're going to call the interact message. We're gonna type in the message that we created in the blueprint interface. And the target is gonna be the thing that it hit. That is all. So we're going to compile that, save it. And now we can send a message out, but it has, it's looking for that specific object that it hit to send the message to. So let's set up a mailbox sort of for these blueprints. So let's go into our sphere. How do we set up this blueprint to be able to receive those messages? If we go into class settings, go down to interfaces we can we can implement the interface through this implement interface uh, tab hit add and we're going to look for the interact the bpi interact set that and down here we got this interact interfaces thing if we double click it now this comes in the form of an event so when it receives the signal it will do what we tell it to so print string we're just going to say sphere and maybe i will change it to red okay compile that save it and we also are going to do it with a cube as well just to make sure that these are separate um this is separate programming so again class settings implemented interfaces we're going to add the interact the bpi interact and we're going to double click what it created over here in the left that opens this, we're going to add our programming, which is print string, and we're going to say cube, and we're going to do this, uh, let's do green. Great, we're going to compile it, save it. Now, let's test it. So here, when I press E, I can send out raycasts from my camera position and, and rotation, and if I hit E on this, we get sphere in the top left. And if I hit this, we get cube in the top left. And I could apply this to a door opening. It's looking for the interact key and then the door could open or I pick up an item or whatever it is. I can do this, the same message and it's such a clean way. There's no casting. There's no like, there's no looking for specific labels or what do you, I think they're called labels. I'm pretty new to Unreal, but I wish I learned this a long time ago and I hope this helps you. 
now that I've learned it, I want to solidify that in my memory. And that's why I made this video. So I hope this helps anyone else looking to easily interact with multiple types of objects in a clean way. Bye bye.